Done with all the pressure I don't need your lecture this time This time, yeah I started singing professionally when I was like 11 years old. I'm originally from San Jose, California. I moved out here when I was 12. Started off with acting and modeling and a little bit of pageants, but through all that, I really got grounded with singing national anthems for different sports teams, also for Manny Pacquiao. I'm half Filipino, half Mexican, so that was like a big plus for me and my family. Being signed a few times to having a song with Kendrick Lamar, you know, working with Justin Bieber, it was a long journey, but it was definitely well worth it. Even if it kills me I hope you can still see Everything I show to you Cause you'll probably never see me again my favorite collaborations I've done in the past, the first one would be Justin Bieber. I was in his baby music video. It's where a lot of people know me from. Shortly went on tour after with him, which was great. It gave me a lot of experience being this big arena, being able to perform. I worked with Problem, I worked with Jeremiah, and also I worked with Tyga in the past, which is great. But one of my favorites by far would have to be Kendrick Lamar. Yeah. Working with the Maid series was amazing because they gave me like that shot again after I took a very long time to, you know, recoup myself and be a mother and take that break. And I've known Bruce and Swift for so many years since I was like 12 years old. So when I got the call from them to work, I was more than excited because they're like family. And it definitely helped a lot. It's giving me the momentum to be back into the studio and to make quality music. And that's all I've ever wanted. First of all, we known Jasmine for a girl since she was 12, since she was a little girl. So we like literally like her bigger brothers, her bigger uncle. And then we saw her perform and she was like off the chain. And she was like, this is this little kid and she just came out and killed it in front of the crowd and everybody's going crazy. And we're like, yo, she's got some. Discovering that, hey, you know, she she wants to, and she's been through some things now. So she wants to get back in the game. And it's like, we, this platform's already there. Like we're already doing this. So that's, it was just a good timing, it was a good, situation she wasn't tied up in any major deals at this point yeah so this is a great re-entry for her it's real low pressure but we're giving the fans what they want and we're going to be providing yeah, for sure. what we need for our platform so it's been amazing watching her uh, just from a little kid to a young adult to now a grown woman it's like it's been amazing she's still the same exact person always smiling no matter what she's going through you know, like she just try to be happy and she loves music. It's like, I feel like she's one, of the, she's one of those artists that whether she has a record deal or not, she's gonna be making music. It's just a passion, it's what she does. And that's the people that we like to 